Dread, me corner tonight. Uh, the reason we're having a second episode, second episode of this is to do with the fact that I am trying to wrap this game up. Um, we don't have very many pursuits left. Cat's rare fist, cat's sail fist, was a trader, cat's a horse, shoe crab. Uh, that kind of thing. Also have to find a particular character who is randomised across the world, which is never fun. But yes. That was a bit odd. I mean, the game's a bit laggy. Okay. So. I'm still looking for a sailfish. Which is supposed to be around here somewhere in the region. Knowing my luck, I will not find it. Okay. We can have a look. That looks like one right there. Of course it is. There we go. Okay. Let's get that. And off to the bloke on the island we go. Also need to get a horseshoe crab. I can't remember where those ones are located. We've already rescued the bloke from there. And they've gone the wrong way. Okay. But yeah. Um, for the next few weeks, there's going to be multiple episodes of this, purely because I am desperate to try and get this game finished up. I love the game a lot, and it's a really nice game, but I do have other series coming up on the channel, so we will be pushing aggressively to get this done. Constructs this off. Yeah, bring the sky. Okay. Ceremonial knife comes out again and a large heart is extracted. It's placed on the stand beside the first. Raised deep. Bigger points to escape on the last scroll. This one is a frilled shark. Okay, that's actually surprisingly straightforward to do. This has to be done at night time. I'm pretty sure anyway. Or it's going to be done right now. Ooh, Twisted Shark. Three tails twist and turn. Three unite behind the head. Thrice the body, they must be fed. Absolutely terrifying. Hopefully it's what he wants. He dragged the Sark's body around to find the right angle before plunging a knife into and pulling out its heart. They place it on the stand beside the others. Without looking, without looking at you, they take a book from inside the robe and throw it into the sand at your feet. Vicky kneels before the three hearts become still. You leap in pine and decide they need any more hearts. Okay. So that's the them done. Let's get to the island.
Okay, fanatic. I'm looking for some relics. Relics say perhaps. One such as this. He pulls out an antique pocket watch from inside his robe. Droplets of sea spray crackle crackle and see from the air around it. We are drawn to it too, I see. I found I'm doing my right of proving the scavenge for creatures of power. It sapped my it sat at my spirits when I first recovered it, but I came to appreciate its strange nourishment with time. As of you, when the ritual is prepared, I will be yours to carry forth. What is that scroll you're holding? I found that at the end of my life it washed ashore, as all the great gifts do. It takes some time for me to decipher the ruins, it ruins it speaks of incomprehensible door. Those wretched twisted fists that swim forth, the flesh is the closest thing to a key. Are there others who say your belief? There are pretenders, failures that make a mockery of the deep. I tried to correcting their ways, but I soon saw they had lost the path. I left them to their ceaseless hunger. Okay. So we got a book out of this. Okay. I'm just going to go and check over the camping spot that's over here. Basically, there is a character I'm trying to find, but he rows, they move around at random. Um, so we, it's basically can purely RNG where he can be found. Okay. Okay, so he's... They're not here, okay. That's annoying. Gonna try and find the next piece. I want to try and get to the lighthouse as well, but we don't have. don't have the explosives, we need to go back to the bloke to get that. I demolished that one and got the flame out of that one. Taking the birth of civilization, we saw that. For the civilization, the light dims and creatures pour out. We need to get all the door pieces to get it open. Okay.
So when it hums quietly, place your hand upon it. Okay, doesn't it respond with touch? I need to get explosives, I think. But I have to go into the ruins, aren't I? Uh, fucking kidding me. Okay. Signing stones. So they want crabs. Okay. Probably be in deep. Okay. Okay. Okay, so we got. I don't remember what book it was we were reading now. Uh, cannot remember. That's not good. Okay. Well, Nautical Engineering is the next one up. I mean, if they just. To be honest. At this point, I don't really notice what the book gives us because they are literally just 
10% this and 10, like 5% that. So it's not something that really captures my attention, to be honest. I mean, if I was going to have, like, I think this is a really good game. If I was going to have a single nit nitpick about it, it would be the fact that the books just feel arbitrary. this. Uh, it's just a flag. I thought it was going to be something useful. Okay. Oh, great, they heard us. Right here, right here, right here. Go away. Calamath. Ancient, battered by years, have gone by its slow eyes. Okay, so that's a super rare fist which we just got rid of by the looks of it. It's not one of the ones we need for a rare catcher rare fist. Oh, it is. Okay. I mean, it'll probably come back eventually. Okay. That's great news. I'll add it to my records. Okay. Fish markets. That's done. Handed over for a nice chump of change. Okay. Get the feeling that we probably need to go down this chain and get crab pots unleashed.
Okay. Let's see what we got in the hold. Okay. Both things that we need. Fantastic. Here. The rock splits apart, it rumbles. Okay. We get some trinkets, we get another one of the fire items. Okay. I'd love to get into the lighthouse. those unlocked. I mean, I never got to use the blinking things. Okay, my storage. Okay, traitor at Little Marrow knows something about it. Wait. The, the traitor at Little Marrow knows something about it. Okay. That's a long... Okay. So, probably have read the description. Let's go and pick up the crap traps. And then we're gonna power it back to where we came. stop in here and then sell some of my excess junk I don't need. So annoying, you you look for them for a whole episode and you don't find them and you literally find them in five minutes and you're not looking for them. Hey, out of a... okay. Let's go with Trader. Find anything special lately? I mean, I have, but you're not letting me. Okay. 
Live a flag. Um. Welcome. You know, I have found stuff, but. I can't seem to talk to him at all. Okay. Then saying pass. Okay. Okay. What's he sold crab pots? Okay. Well, I came the whole way here because it said talk to the talk to the trader. He might know more. So on the stone tablet. Trader takes the stone tablet from you and inspects it closely, turning it over in his hands. Remarkable, yes, I do believe this is a fragment of a larger arrangement. He reaches up to self and brings down a similar looking stone, albeit one covered in much more dust. Some years ago I acquired this other piece. You found this near the ruins of the Vespine, didn't you? Yes. Well, I suspect there will be more out there. I hold on to this for now and study it further until you reach the other fragments. In the meantime, okay. Uh, pursuits. Find more of the tablets. Whatever, wherever they are. Okay. Light the statues. Catch a horseshoe crab. Catch rare fish. Okay. Also, crab can be found in the mangroves. Okay, or well, the twisted strand. Um, by the looks of it, because I know. Yeah. So we need to go there if we want to actually catch those. Okay. Remember, he's on these islands somewhere around here, if I recall. Right.
Let's get in. Hmm. It's like... I'll grab that. i grab that. But it is like the... Um, I need to pick that up. I got all my money. It's like all the crab pots have disappeared. It's in the, that zone. Okay. So they're all in here. Right. Let's rest. I just need a single horseshoe crab. Ugh, come on, mate. Of course, it's not going to be that easy. Okay. Problem is, there's no big fish out here that makes it profitable to fish. Little fish, okay. Just my luck. Right. Problem is, none of these fish in the mangroves are actually worth that much. I just need a horseshoe crab. That's all I need. Uh. No, that's more fish again. No, that's got the crashed aeroplane on it. Okay. At least we know this is the bloke who wants to horse who crabs. Okay. Right. Let's get back to port. If nothing else, I'll do a bit of quick fishing. Okay, never 
glowing mullet. Won't make as much money. Yeah, a little bit, nothing to break, to take home to the bank. Some more explosives. Let's, let's sleep. Hopefully we will catch this horse or crab. Picked up horseshoe crab. Okay. Let's grab the, these nets, these pots, and then we can go and do that. Constantly making progress. Scarlet prawns. Excellent. If you're lucky, he'll ask for scarlet prawns, and then we'll have exactly what he, everything he wanted. Yeah. I think it turns to cover over to expose it soft on the body. He scoops out its innards and with his soft fingers, consuming them blindly. Consume the sky. He just wants one of those. Okay. That's it. I mean, you find them all over the place around here. Oh, it's a red snapper. I mean, they're up here, aren't they? I recall. Dolphins. Let's grab some tuna. Blackfin tuna. We'll get good pay out of that. Okay. There we go. We got the fish he wanted, we can go back now and drop that off, and it is done. And then we got a bit of a race, unfortunately. Okay, let's get this dropped off. Let's consume the sky. Oh, that's the wrong fish. It's a burly eye. Yeah, and that's a grey mullet. Okay, that's fine. Have to make a rust for port then. And we're fairly within range. I'm pretty sure I've caught one of those things before, so I know where they are. I mean, I don't really want to sleep. I want to get to the merchant who is down here.
Okay. Yeah, for all that work, we hardly catch anything. Okay. So. He wants a Bissell fish. Uh, a burly eye. And then the Stellabation. So it's fairly easy to do. Rod, yeah, okay. That will be straightforward. Got a couple more things to do. Tablets, and the, I got two of the flames, just the third one to go, and then we're done with that. All good, all good, all good. So what I think I might do quickly allow this to tick over and let's see if we can catch I don't like our chances of that thing Okay. They say it's abyssal, so it's going to be a deep fish. No, that's not the one I want. Neither is that one. Okay. Might be these ones. Yeah, here we go. There we go. We'll quickly grab that. We'll zip back to. We'll zip back to the bloke on the rock, and give that to him, and then we'll go to a location and save. And then we'll be done for the episode because we'll have made decent progress. We've only a few things left to go. Okay, natural engineering. Okay, so wrong thing. Natural engineering. Equipment types so that use durability will lose it 50% slower. Okay. Like this is the thing I said. Unfortunately, I just don't care. Um like it would be cool if we if it came with lore, if reading the books had like lore snippets or something, but they don't. So all it is is a stat boost. And it's a percentage stat boost as well, which to be honest, after a while you get a bit bored of seeing. Right. Let's just get to this island. He should be around here somewhere. Here we go. Big up begins to clean the fish head first. Gnashing teeth searching for the heart of the thing. When the fish is gone, he stops and throws it aside. They take a book from inside the robe and give it to you. The sky will fall. They cross your arms and appear to wait. So yeah, these must be the other monks that the ancient bloke on the island tells us about. The ones that were like his fellow survivors from his ancient civilization. Right, let me just get to the, the docking point and we'll be good to go. Okay. Right. 
Bis dann. This will be a good place to end, folks. I've been Quantus Knight. This has been Dredd, and I'll see you again next time. Goodbye.